Guys, welcome back to the channel. A quick additional update here on JustMe. So JustMe is seeing that breakdown, which we discussed in the previous update. So I will talk about the imminent short-term price actions, the support level and everything you need to know. Make sure that you like this video, subscribe to my channel. If you want to join my trade signal group, click the first link in the description or just scan the code on the right side of your screen. Lastly, follow me on Twitter, Steph underscore crypto for the latest updates. So this is the four hourly time frame for just me and in the previous update we spoke about yeah the bearish divergence on the four hourly rsi and also that a potential breakdown was very likely to expect and that is exactly what happened so yeah in the previous update from a few hours ago earlier today just me was trading on top of the 0.382 fibonacci level right now we broke uh, below it and right now we are finding some support here at the point of control at 0.0037 seven so this breakdown was already what we expected and yeah what is the next support for uh just me um <clears throat> i will talk about that at the moment the momentum indicator is still pushing to the downside so we can still experience more negative momentum in the imminent short term for just me uh the stochastic rsi is almost at the floor but we can still push a little bit lower i think so that's definitely very likely to expect in terms of support levels uh, i will switch over here to the hourly time frame and what we then can do is we can draw a fibonacci retracement level from this bottom towards this top here and at the moment you can see that we are below the 0 0.3 236 Fibonacci level so the next imminent area of support uh, is located somewhere around the 357 level uh, and that would be the 0 0.382 Fibonacci support level so that would be the next area of support you can also see this red line the point of control of this entire price range here from off the uh, end of December is also aligning perfectly with the 0 0.382 Fibonacci level so somewhere in that range I do expect some support for just me let's see if we can get some kind of a bounce out of here if not then we will go lower towards this blue line here which is the golden pocket and then i'm looking at this kind of structure then this was all wave one to the upside we then are coming down in a wave two to the downside not in a straight line it will be with ups and downs and then we will move up impulsively in a wave three that's the structure i'm looking at the other scenario is that this wave one is not yet in this was a wave one two uh, possible wave three i would say maybe here a wave three and we are right now in a wave four that's also a possibility and that there will be one more lag to the upside for just me but yeah let's see how the price will develop in the next few hours and days ahead of us tomorrow is an important day the cpi data release will get out so we will get a lot of volatility all across the market and also of course for just me but just be aware support below us located at 361 resistance above us is located at 388 so those are the imminent levels to watch for just me in the short term um what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna zoom out here for you guys just to take a look at the longer term indicators here so we are now on the daily time frame and as you can see just me broke outside of this downward sloping resistance line and the technical target is all the way here at 4.5 cents so at some point we should see a massive price explosion that's why i'm personally uh, thinking that this is one of the last chance chances that we are getting to get just me for these very very cheap prices that's just my opinion do with that whatever you want but i think it is very smart to take advantage of these uh, low prices. Um, yeah, on the daily time frame, the momentum is still under a buy signal. Still, we can still experience positive momentum in the in the yeah short term in the next few days, according to this indicator. RSI on the daily time frame currently sitting at fifty seven. So yeah, a lot of room to go higher from of this point, and. The stochastic RSI, however, is sitting um, in the overbought region. So according to this indicator, uh, we could experience more downside pressure in the imminent short term. But that's also in line with the four hourly RSI. So just be aware of that, guys. Uh, it's all looking healthy still. Let's see where the price is going to pull back towards. Um, I think personally, the bear market low for just me was in here at the swing low we have made here on when was it the end of December? I see this with a lot of cryptos. Uh, what you don't want to see is that just me breaks back into the falling wedge. That's absolutely not what you want to see. 
the worst case scenario is that we are going to retest this wedge uh, as support and then see more further continuation to the upside. But let's see how that will play out. I'll be back tomorrow with a more detailed update. Let's uh, hope that we will see a lot more volatility. Um, I want to thank you guys for watching and for the support and I'll see you in the next update. Bye bye.